Hello friends, welcome back with another tutorial. This is Moshe Dali. Today I am here to share you some important ideas about the primary knowledge of voice sense. So now, no stage of time, let us enter into the class. So my dear friend, you have to subscribe my YouTube channel to get more videos, to get new videos. Please subscribe at once my uh, channel and update yourself with knowledge. So before entering into the class perfectly, we have to know some ideas or we have to know some definition about voice. So what is voice? This is our question and at the same time I am trying to uh, answer this question. Okay now, the form of verb which simply works on subject and object in a sentence. The form of verb which simply works on subject or object in a sentence is called voice. So my dear students, we have learned about voice, that means what is voice, now come to another point, voice sense, what is voice sense, in simple sense we can say that voice sense is a type of transformation of sentence. Now another point, my dear student or my dear learners about the type of voice sense. We know that there are two types of voice. One is active voice, another is passive voice. One is active voice and another is passive voice. In the sentence, a subject was being active is called active voice. In the example, we can uh, see that or uh, in the example we see that Kamal Bhai plays cricket. Now come to the another point, another part of voice that means passive passive voice in the sentence per subject works per subject works without Activeness that means being inactive is called passive voice. As an example, we can say that cricket is played by Kamal Bhai. Cricket is played by Kamal Bhai in our previous uh, active voice. I showed you uh, this example, that's why for your better understanding, I have used here this example. Plus, we have to know about the subjective form and objective form to uh, sense voice from active to passive. So, uh, we find that the subjective form of I and its objective form is me. I subjective form its objective form is me, and we subjective form its objective form is as you subjective form its objective form is you he or subjective form and its objective form is him she is subjective form and its objective form is her and they is a subjective form and its objective form is them it is a subjective form and its objective form is it and any other names such as Harun, the subjective form is Harun. Life is a struggle, struggle is life, said by Alfred Tennyson, one of the Victorian poet. He wants to make understand that we cannot gain anything without any labor. That means, how do we want to get in our lives as perfect or complete shape? We have to uh, struggle hard, that means we have to work hard 
otherwise we will not be able to gain that matter so similarly to gain knowledge we have to struggle hard so now friend we have to remember this remember this statement of Albert Tennyson and we have to practice again and again this voices to gain more knowledge about it so no more today see you again in the next class with any other sentence of voices thank you all